Hi guys and good morning. I literally just woke up. That's why I look like a mess. But in my house, it's so cold here. So I love to just walk around in a robe. So excuse me looking a little bit crazy. But in today's video, I wanted to do what I eat in a day as a breastfeeding mom. And honestly, I like the breakfast. I kind of eat the same breakfast every day. And can't, not like the same lunch and dinners, but I have like the same stuff that I like. So I'm going to show you guys what my go-to meals are. And I also try to eat a lot of vegetables and fruits and like getting a lot of nutrients since I'm breastfeeding. And I want my baby to get the best milk. And um, honestly, this is how I've been eating like for years too. Like I always like to eat a lot of vegetables and fruits and stuff. And I feel like that's very important for a healthy diet and a healthy body and yeah so i'm gonna show you guys what i eat and we're gonna start off with breakfast so for breakfast i've been loving to eat egg and cheese sandwich and i always toast one of these slices and this is just some whole grains healthy multigrain bread and then i just make two eggs and i use one like the whole egg and then the other one i take away the yellow part and only use the white part then i put on a cheese slice and some butter first of course and then a cheese slice and i usually put it in in the microwave uh, for like only 10 seconds because i like the cheese to be a little bit melted and then i put on the eggs <laughs> every morning and i love this one from um, elite coffee oh my god i think i'm getting sick or something my nose is like it's like really so much oh god so i always put it's like one and a half teaspoon and then some Hot water. It's my favorite cup <laughs> from Target. All Mama wants is a silent night. That's true. And I fill it with water like a little bit more than halfway. And then I put some milk. I'm just regular milk. So my baby's just crying in the background. I'm not sure why. 
It's been so crazy. And then I put my favorite creamer from Starbucks. Or, yeah, from Starbucks, but I buy it from Ross. And it's white chocolate mocha. And I love this one. So I put candle. Okay, so it's time for lunch now and I'm gonna make some salmon and mashed potatoes but I'm already made mashed potatoes yesterday that I ate so I have some leftovers that I'm gonna eat and also Rafi's mom made a cabbage salad so I'm gonna eat that I'm gonna show you guys how to do the salmon so I already have the mashed potatoes here just regular and then the cabbage salad that looks like this and I have had the salmon out in this bowl because it was a frozen salmon. So now I unfroze it for like three hours, I would say, in cold water. So now it's ready to eat. And I, I'm just actually going to open the package and I'm going to put it in the Ninja. I'm going to show you guys. Every time I make like salmon or meat or something, I always, or chicken, I put it in this Ninja. So the way I do it is I press on the grill. Oops, obviously start first. Grill, and it comes to 500, and the start. This takes about like five minutes, and then I put in the salmon for about like, I would say seven, eight minutes. And I season with black pepper, salt, and garlic salt. I love my salmon so much. I think I'm eating salmon at least like, at least two times a week, two, three times a week. And so tasty, so healthy, and so good. And I usually buy like a big pack from Costco, the frozen one. I think like a big pack is around maybe like 45 bucks and you get like at least 10, I think 10 pieces. So it's a really good price, honestly, because sometimes if you go to like Ross or something and buy fresh, you get one piece for like 10 bucks and here you get 10 pieces for like 45, 50 bucks. So it's really good. And it doesn't matter if it's frozen, honestly, it tastes the same way. I've been trying many different sorts of salmon, but it tastes exactly the same. You just have to put it out for like, maybe like three hours before or overnight in the fridge, and then it's ready to eat. And while when I'm using it, the Ninja is just so easy. Literally, you just put it in for seven minutes, eight minutes, and you don't even need to stand like, and watch it in the oven or something, or like cook it on the stove. You literally just put it in there. So easy. Okay guys, this is the final result. So yummy. He doesn't let me eat. He was just crying and he just wants to be my mom all the time. He just want mama to hold you all the time. No, I want to eat too. So it's time for dinner and I was craving El Polo Loco so much. So I told my man, please, can you go get me some? So he just went to get some. And I always eat the queso blanco burrito. It has chicken, rice, beans, uh, guacamole, queso blanco, and the tomato thing. I don't know what it's called. Pico de gallo, I think. But it's so good. So yeah, when it comes home, I'm going to eat it and I'm going to show you guys. Also, I always get the creamy cilantro dressing too. Ah, oh, it's so good. So it's getting pretty late, but I'm still a little hungry and I don't want to go to bed hungry because I'm breastfeeding and I need all the nutrients I can get. If I don't eat like a night snack, I literally wake up when he wakes me up around like five. I'm starving so sometimes I even have to go and do like eat oatmeal or something because I can't even go back to sleep because I'm so hungry so it works best for me just to eat like an hour two hours before bed and I'm just gonna have some yogurt with cereal and some oats because oats is really good for breast milk production I think I heard it but I'm not sure but I think so 
and i usually eat oatmeal almost every day but today i didn't eat it so i'm just gonna have some oats inside my cereal with yogurt and i'm also gonna eat some apples and orange every day i'm trying to have uh, even if i have a smoothie in the morning with uh, berries i always trying to have a fruit plate later in the day like with apples orange or like melon mango like i love fruit so much and i eat a lot of fruit so yeah i'm gonna make some apples and orange oh my god i love this christmas crunch so much in sweden we do not really have this type of cereal i think i never really tried it but my man he loves it so he got me hooked on it it's not good to eat every day, but I feel like sometimes you can just have a little bit. It's fine. <laughs> 